I just try and try and go to LA in those months and film First Love and then come back for the 24 days of sun in London. That's the, that's the ideal setup anyway. Yeah, I was going to ask, you must spend a lot of time in LA. A fair bit. Um, I don't have like a base out there at all. I just love to go when there's a job opportunity out there and I know a fair few people out there so yeah anytime there's an excuse to get out to LA I'll be there but because I'm so lucky to travel so much for my work I feel like my holidays are spent at home like when I have time off I'm just at home just catching up with friends and stuff but um, no I love LA I really do. Did you so you did you film First Love in LA? Yeah yeah do you know what I stay have you seen this the Borat not the second one, the, the most recent Borat. Yes. Um, and I've forgotten her name because she's the best actress in the, not because, but I've forgotten her name. She's the best actress in the world. The woman, the girl who plays like Borat's daughter, or, or I think it's his daughter. Yes. And she's she has like, a tough name. She's not, she not acting. She is being, she's undercover. She's like a spy. Like I can't believe she's done that so flawlessly, but apparently she stayed at the same accommodation, the same Airbnb I was in when we were shooting First Love, which was like, West Hollywood, not near enough. And all the locations were like 20 minutes away. So it was really cool to be able to just kind of feel like you're living in LA, filming something in LA, the characters in LA, everything didn't feel like we're on a movie set. It just felt like we're here and we're being and we're doing. So that yeah, was really cool, yeah. That's I was great. Re religiously getting matcha from, what's it called? Matcha matcha, I think it's called. Yeah, is that matcha, what it's Like the green. Yeah, the one yeah, in, yeah, um, yeah. The one in, what's the one in New York called, Rhea? Cafe Matcha? I, I forget what it is. Something but they have like, all the yeah. sayings because it's matcha, They're all the same. So they like, they make up yeah. all the sayings on the wall. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. That's the one. And uh, I can't lie, man. I hate myself. I really hate myself. But now I drink oat milk and I love matcha. And it's really sad. I get rinsed for it, but I was going to say that sounds like a very LA thing to do. And it is, it is. It's we've it's only been to LA a couple times, and we just try to stay away from falling into that. We're like, we can't yeah, start eating know, healthy. Why. We got to stick to ourselves. <laughs> I know it got me. Oh, I'm never going to do the like sweet green and religiously every day. I'm going in and out and Chick Fil A. That that will never change. Thank that God. Change. That's all. We can, that's all we can ask for. <laughs> <laughs> I it's just I can I can imagine morning. yeah I can no, imagine the it. your friend I can imagine your friends at home in uh in England would love to give you shit for that. Yes, definitely, definitely. <laughs> Until I put them on and then they try it and they're like, oh damn, well, you're onto something now. <laughs> like these LA people, they may know what they're talking about. Uh, but yeah, your movie I mean, first not love... so much with the gluten free stuff, but yeah. <laughs> oh no, forget that. Yeah. Sometimes.